everyone, my name is Lynn Fenzel and I am with my friend Shay and we're sitting in her backyard in California where it's beautiful in January. Fabulous. Um, we're here to debunk the top four reasons why people say I cannot be a beach body coach. And she's going to start? I get to start. You get to start? Fantastic. Okay, so I'm going to share, uh, we're going to alternate, but I'm going to do two. And this is one of the reasons that I said I could not be a beach Probably body the coach. number one reason. Probably. That I hear too. I, I would agree with you, for sure. Because it's, I have a lot of weight to lose. I'm not done with my journey. How can I possibly be a coach? No one will listen to what I have to say. Right? I mean. Exactly. I said that. You said that. <laughs> okay, so did I. I said that. When I first met the coach that I signed up with, I had about 50 pounds more on me than I do right now. And I said, there's just no way. Like, nobody's going to listen to what I have to say. The truth of the matter is, is that people watch you on your journey. They are inspired by you. And they watch what you're doing and how consistent you are. And then they want to do that too because they've seen that you can do it. Um, there is a coach that's a Beachbody coach, and I've listened to her tell her story a couple times. She found out that she had cancer not too long after she had started coaching. And when she found that out, she called up her upline and she said, H how can I be a Beachbody coach? I'm going to be sick. I'm going to be having radiation and chemotherapy. Who is going to listen to me? Who's going to want to hear what I have to say? And her coach said the very simple truth, which was everyone. Because the thing is, is that people, it always chokes me up. I've never met her, but I'm so inspired by that because she completed her journey and she journaled the whole thing and took everybody that was following her along with her journey. And she always says that Beachbody coaching helped her get through her cancer. And for me, being a coach helps me stay accountable to my own goals, Absolutely. keeps me on that journey because other people are counting me and other people mm -hmm. are watching me. So I don't want to quit. Right? Exactly. All right. Perfect. That's number one. So number two, and this might be right, honestly be the number two reason that I hear from people, um, is I'm not a coach. Um, I have no fitness background, no nutrition yeah. background. You know, where's my credibility? Who, who would listen to me? Um, I said that. You said that. Um, <laughs> So More I'm uh, I'm married to a coach. Um, he's been a he's a college football coach, and he, but he's been a coach since the day he graduated high school. Um, and he and I were talking when I first signed up to be a coach, and I was like, oh, I can't even say the word. Like it just doesn't. I'm not a coach. And he said, you know, he said, Lynn, everybody wants to be coached. In it doesn't matter what you're doing, but people just want to be coached. And I I. I listened to that and I thought about it a lot and and um, I know that the word coach implies somebody with a whistle around their neck and is coaching an athletic team or is coaching individual athletes um, but that's really not not everything it means in fact coaching is seeing the potential in people before they see it in themselves and it's empowering them to reach that potential and I it's just love that empowering it is them. it's I motivating it. them it's encouraging them when they're having hard days and and it's also practicing what you preach it's walking the walk and um and that's what that's what beach body coaching is it's it's all about being an accountability partner or a success partner for some of your challenge group challengers or your coaches um and i guess that's we're on to number three <laughs> okay oh goodness all right number three I love that. And you're so good at all of that. I love that. Okay, sorry. I digress. All right. Number three. I don't have time to be a beach body coach. I've got a full time job. I'm a mom. I have all these things I'm trying to do. Three kids. Okay. Or just two boys yeah. that keep you very busy. Um, how can I possibly have time for this business? Well, again, when I first became a coach, I was actually working full time outside of the home in a veterinary practice because I am by trade a veterinarian. And that's exactly what I said. And you know what my upline said to me? Um, this is really funny. We're good friends. But she said, Shay, you're already talking about it all the time. And so people are calling me and asking me for it. So you may as well be doing it for yourself. So true. Um, and that's, that's true, right? Because I had such passion for the products because I was having mm -hmm. success with them and I was feeling so good that I shared it with anyone and everyone who would listen. And that's really all you're doing. I mean, you can put as much or as little time into this business 
and you will get what you put into it. So if you put in a little bit of time, maybe you'll have a few people who help you pay for, pay your, for your own. Yeah. yeah. Yep. But if you put in more time, then your business will be more successful. It <clears throat> truly and truly is up to you. Maybe you don't want to do anything more than just be a discount coach and get your own shakes at a discount. You get what you put into it, and there's really not a factor of time here, no. right? Because now Great. I'm totally obsessed, and yeah. I have left my full-time job as a veterinarian, and I do this full-time, and I sit here in the sunshine, and I stay home yeah. with my kids. And so make little videos. Not a bad deal <laughs> in my backyard. <laughs> Okay, okay, number, yeah. number four, it's um, it's just another multi-level marketing scam, I don't know, um, and I don't want to invest a lot of money in something that I'm going to just lose lose out on. Mm -hmm. um, first of all, it's a $40 investment to become a coach. I, I signed up as a coach when I ordered a challenge pack, you get the free upgrade, and I, like Shay said, I was only going to do it for a discount. I, I'm going to be truthful here. When I signed up, I signed up at the end of the month, and I had $80 in my checking account. And um, I, uh, I didn't even tell my husband, for obvious reasons. But I felt really passionate about the product. And I had some goal, personal goals that I needed to reach. And I was like, I'm going to do this. And I had her right by my side. And here I am today. Um, so the investment is in you. It's $40 in you. You're going to get, you know, your product and you're going to turn around and you're going to put it into yourself. And, and if you decide this isn't for you, then it's simply emailing the company and saying, I don't want to do this. And that's it. There's no penalty for changing your mind. Um, there's no you're contract. Not difficult. It's not mm -hmm. difficult. There's no contract to sign. And the other thing um, is you don't have to carry a bunch of inventory, a bunch of product. You, you purchase your shake or whatever you want, and that's yours. And then your customers purchase their own, and it's shipped directly to them. There's no, the other thing that's lovely is there's no parties, necessarily. No, there are um, no parties. There's no... Uh, I mean, we can have a party. We have parties. <laughs> but there's no you standing in front of a room for 30 people who really don't want to be there, but they're just there because the host invited them. Right. And there's none of that. Um, I mean, there could be if you really wanted to do it that way. There have been people, honestly. <laughs> there have been people who have been successful doing it. It's just not my style. It's not my style. style. We, we we don't do see little that. fitness yeah. groups. And we'll, yeah. she'll teach insanity and we'll bring people in no. that way. But... Um, and if you're looking at it like, you know, if you think this is just another salesman job and you need to, you know, put on your, get your salesman pitch and go out there and sell, 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 then you need to really rethink it, your investment because um, what you're really trying to do is change people's lives and, and change their lives either physically, transform their lives physically or financially. And it's about... Or both, exactly. And it's about people, helping people, giving them guidance to reach their goals that they have for themselves. So, Reaching for the stars, right? Yeah. That's what we're doing. Yep. That's awesome. All right. Good job. Good job. Yeah. All right, bye. If you have any questions? Have a good day. <laughs> Let us know. All right. Now i got to go turn it off. <laughs> I'll just sit here. Okay. Later.